Uh, foi um dia positivo no sentido de que a gente conseguiu avançar para os duelos no qualifying, é algo que a gente queria há muito tempo, é mostrar nosso ritmo de qualifying. E foi uma surpresa que isso acontecesse aqui em Berlim, porque não é uma pista onde a gente acha que o nosso carro se, se, se dá muito bem né, com essa pista. Então foi uma surpresa positiva, acredito que muito se deve aos ajustes que os engenheiros fizeram no carro. É, e aí eu também acertei a volta, a gente qualificou em sétimo. Na corrida a gente não conseguiu manter essa posição, a gente veio muito bem até metade da corrida, como de costume, aliás, e depois parece que os outros <risos> têm muito mais energia que a gente, e aí a corrida vai embora. Acho que a gente podia ter otimizado mais, extraído mais o carro, eu não gostei muito da estratégia, como a gente tomou os attack modes e tal, vou começar com a equipe agora, eu sempre posso tentar melhorar minha pilotagem, os engenheiros com a estratégia, quem sabe a gente junta essas duas coisas amanhã e consegue... <risos> e consegue chegar nos pontos. Yeah, I finished in P5 today from P9. Look, I, I need to take that. Uh, it was a bit of a scrappy race, just in terms of strategy, and I sort of dropped back at one point and managed to get myself back into the contention with the front group, but just lost a bit of ground. And um, yeah, it just hasn't, hasn't been a, a normal day for us. You know, overall sort of uh, performance has been a little bit, a little bit uh, down, but um, look, we'll, we'll analyze today and, and try and make some changes and be stronger tomorrow. Bom, estava a ser uma corrida boa, fizemos um bom arranque, uh, uma fase inicial da corrida a andar para a frente, consegui, consegui passar o Sims, ficar em segundo e ir com o Mortara, estava a ser eficiente, a poupar alguma energia, uh, acho que a estratégia nos attack modes não foi a melhor, acabámos por, por perder algumas posições no todo dos attack modes, não, 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 não gerimos bem essa parte, uh, e depois no final da corrida entrou um saco de plástico no radiador onde fez o carro todo sobreaquecer e quando isto acontece uh, ficamos sem potência, é um, entrou em safety mode o carro basicamente e acabei por perder 4 ou 5 posições na última volta, que enfim, a probabilidade disto acontecer é quase nula, é o que é, aconteceu. Uh, analisar hoje tudo o que podemos melhorar para amanhã e temos um dia começar do zero e estou confiando que temos um bom carro, por isso começar do zero e amanhã é um novo dia. Stoff, amazing recovery, incredible. Uh, yeah, well, uh, great, uh, great recovery today, to be honest. Uh, I wasn't expecting to be on the podium after uh, lap one. I was, yeah, kind of, everything went wrong on lap one. I was in the wrong places, everyone was overtaking me. Uh, I, I, yeah, I was losing places everywhere. But then once I got settled in, I, I, you know, I kind of felt that I had a good car. I was, uh, I was feeling competitive, and and I managed to carve my way back through. So, uh, yeah, it was a, an incredible recovery from there. Um, I had a, yeah, had a really enjoyable race actually, and I almost felt like I was so close to win the race actually at some point. But uh, you know, I, I think once I got into that front group of cars, I, I didn't want to get too greedy and too. And, and you know pushing too much to try and win the race because in the end you can lose more than than uh, than gain more and um, you know today it was good to settle for p3 and and to score another good points how different is the uh, the track the reverse track tomorrow uh, it's quite different um, you know balance of the car is uh, is quite different uh, the characteristic of the track is, is very different and um, yeah I think the only point we really have is the, the the tarmac that we can learn from in terms of how to work the tires so um, yeah that's going to be the biggest challenge Coisa difícil uh, eu tive um, uma o pneu furou num contato que eu tive na volta 1 acho que com o Roland e eu fui perdendo ar aos poucos a cada volta eu perdia é, meia libra de pressão, depois foi perdendo, 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 até o momento, até a volta 10 eu consegui segurar o carro, mas a partir de um ponto o carro começou a ficar inguiável, eu tive que abandonar e parar, e parar no box para trocar o pneu e daí a corrida já tinha acabado. É bastante diferente, acho que principalmente o ponto, principalmente as, as referências, principalmente é, como pilotar, cada curva muda totalmente o approach, muda totalmente o jeito de fazer a curva, mas o setup do carro e todas as outras coisas são meio parecidos. Great down, man. Great down. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Does perfection exist on Formula E? Perfection? No, 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 no. For it sure was not. a perfect race. Was it? Yeah. No, uh, I was under uh, under um, a lot of uh, pressure actually from the guys be, uh, behind. Yeah. And uh, but I'm very happy actually that uh, it went this way. Yeah. Uh, already the pole position was mega, was amazing, and uh, to keep the the lead the entire time with a lot of pressure and you know with slipstream it's very easy for the guys behind you know to under consume. So it's very difficult when you're first you know to to keep the the first place. The strategy was very late uh, attack modes, both of them. 
So I was trying basically to, to have a good gap, let's say to go take it and not lose uh, so much like uh, it worked out perfectly and uh, yeah, very happy. You're having a fantastic season. Is it the car, is it you or is it both? Fantastic season. Uh, I'm having a positive season. Um, I was coming actually from 3DNF. Or two DNF, sorry. Before, before then, we had a start, very good start of the season. Yeah, uh, yeah you're right. But I, I had lost a little bit, you know, the, the um, you know, the, the, the first play, the, the, the first guys, like in the in the championship. So for me, it was very important actually to have a very good result today. Now this is done. I hope that tomorrow it's going to be another good one. Where does your mind go when you have a second a second race in the next day? You need to stay focused. Uh, and it's very difficult because after such a day, you would like to be very happy to celebrate. To um, to be uh, yeah to, to enjoy you know with uh, with your team with your family but you can't because tomorrow there's another one it's as important as this one so we need to switch and already focus for tomorrow. Thank you, the